man. <laughs> yeah, well. But to kind of piggyback off your whole internet kind of ruining things, mm. um, on the other side, if it does pull up something like, you know, say, Smash Brothers, mm. that can kind of get you hyped to wonder what's going to be on there. Mm. Like, they already released a lot of characters. There's Ike, there's Marth, there's you know, Son- Sonic, all of Mars. So you already know who's going to be in there. They said Sonic? They said Sonic, I'm pretty sure. I don't know. I mean, yeah. I. Anyways, hmm. but the, uh, <laughs> speaking of which, who do you guys think is going to make the roster? I mean, they still haven't finished it, that's for sure. Well, for Smash Brothers, right? For Smash Brothers, yeah. The new one that's coming out. Just that's coming out, out there. Cool. Fran and I are going to E3. We'll find out on uh, E3. Tuesday. <laughs> uh, check this channel for like vlogs and stuff of cool footage of video games. But yeah. But uh, I'm pretty sure Mario will be in it. Yes. Mm. Um, Luigi. Mm-hmm. Mm. I'm hoping for Star Fox. Yes. Oh. <laughs> Have they rust. released him already? Huh? Have they already put him on there? Star Fox, I believe he's I think he might be there. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he's on the roster. I'm pretty so, sure they have all the staples. Those are... Well, a lot of people are confused because they haven't had anything about uh, Captain Falcon yet. Oh. Yeah. And he's been since but the But he has to one. be on there. Yeah. Or so, Ness or yeah. Lucas. So, since you're asking about predictions, I will say, I think the reason why they haven't announced him yet is probably at E3 they're going to announce, because it's been a while since there's been a new F-Zero game. Yeah. They're probably going to announce a new F-Zero game, and on that same day, boom, Captain Falcon's available to play on Smash Brothers. Dum, dum, dum. Because they usually link that stuff up, like, with, uh, integrate it with, like, releases and stuff like that. Like, right after the Mario game came out and uh, Rosalina was an unlocked, unlockable character, they're like, she's in the new Smash game. Yeah. So they usually uh, line it up like that. I'm hoping, Nintendo <clears throat> doesn't usually do this, but I'm hoping there's, like, somehow a new IP that they just bring out and boom we get an all new character we wouldn't even expect because they've never used that type of character well before. here's the thing the uh, another company who's actually helping to work on the game is Namco so you have a whole another set of mm, games that right. means Nintendo bought out Sega I think yeah. that's how they got Sonic yeah and then they also had the rights to uh, Solid Snake too, so he was another addition. I think that was more of a like one time off thing. I don't I don't think we'll see him again, but we might. We might. But think about it this way: Can you imagine Pac Man in the game or Dig Dug in the I, game? I can imagine Pac Man, and I have imagined Pac Man, and it was a great imaginary dream that I had. <laughs> <laughs> so the the version I want is the one where remember on PlayStation when they tried to do three D stuff that like sucked. Yeah. So they were like Bandicoot. a walking Pac Man that's like just this big ball with arms and legs. I want that guy in Smash Brothers. Pac-Man has arms? Yeah, yeah and on PlayStation 1 or 2. Waka, or waka, waka, waka. He was like walking. <laughs> it's just this huge circle that still goes like this, and thin ass, ar- like my arms and my legs. <laughs> out of the how would that be a fighter? Because, <laughs> like, think about how he doesn't reach really that well, and then he'll just roll up on you. And the you only know. thing I can see Pac-Man doing is it's so terrible. Of course, he's going to bite you. Like, like, yeah, Wario did it, and, so, like, why not? Wario? Yeah. But that was, I just don't see a, a, an expansive move set for him. I, j- I didn't really see how they're gonna do Mega Man. I don't see it. that was crazy. How and how? But he has so many <laughs> moves. <laughs> that is, that yeah. What? <laughs> but I was trying to see like the down smash. I didn't when they released a moveset how it worked. Mm-hmm. Then it made sense because well, he had like you, it looked like you can change his moveset's really crazy. Yeah. don't get me wrong. But the fact that it's really crazy just goes to show how crazy his moveset could be. Yeah, so yeah. that just shows like you could do a lot more than you probably think with. Yeah, I what, feel like Pac Man. I mean, I think you can do anything with Villager. No, no, like, but, uh, or the new uh, punch out guy, I forgot his name. Little Mac. Yeah, oh, Little Mac's yeah, Little Mac. I don't understand, like. He's going to play, like, Balrog from Street Fighter. <laughs> so he's just going to punch. Except for he's not black. But so, he's like, a there's, there's only so much you can do, like, with punches. I guess you can yeah. do, like, a no, right hook. So he's going to have a different set of moves, like, strong attack, weak attack for everything. Each is going to have three variations. Oh, wow. So his moveset's probably going to be the most complex out of pretty okay. much all the characters. Even though stuff. he has two hands that he hits with. Yes. <laughs> and no weapons? And no weapons. All right. His but boxing he, gloves are reach. weapons in themselves. He's got pretty crazy reach. Not reach like Marth, by the way. Which they just add, they announced new yeah. Fire Emblem characters again, which is dope. Marth and Ike. Mar- yeah. yeah. No more Roy. I think it was bad. Precious Roy. Everybody Precious Roy. Roy. Too, I think. But think about the other Namco games they have. Uh, Tekken. Yeah. Or Star Wars. Ooh. Namco made games for Star Wars. But... Mm, but probably not anymore after the new buyout that they did with the Disney licensing oh, and all yeah. that stuff. I doubt that would be the Unless case. Unless you start putting Mickey Mouse in Smash Brothers. That would mm. be pretty crazy to have someone with a oh. big-ass license. <laughs> so, oh, a, re- a requested character I have would be Tails from Sonic, if they do bring Sonic oh, back. Oh, that would That'd be, be awesome. awesome. That would be pretty dope. That might be like a surprise character, too. Why not too, Knuckles, then? That would be cool, yeah, too. Yeah, Knuckles would be cool, but, like, I mean, fucking the Tails tail, could though. fly. Mm. What would his final Smash be? Just Super Tails? I'm not sure, but his up B would be so dope. You're down there... You come, he, put, he puts his goggles back on <laughs> and like flies up. 
His yeah. taunts would be dope as hell. Yeah, he'd like flip his tail around or something. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Let's go get this tail. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what he'd do. Like, yeah. Although he's a boy or a girl? He's I'm just a boy. Oh, okay. From that standpoint, instead of like predicting who we think is going to be in this one, because I mean, it's it's they've already announced a lot of new characters. I'm pretty sure some of the old characters. Who do you want to see besides like Pac Man or Tails? Like, who else would you want to see? Like. Anybody, anybody or just anybody? Oh, man. Okay, I'm going to jump in here. Actually, I'm going to get a little <laughs> bit closer to the microphone because I want y'all to hear this. Um, I'm a big fan of Dr. Mario, and I want him in the next Ooh, one. Yep. Why they didn't bring him back for a brawl made me sad, but please, please, whoever created that game, I don't know your <laughs> name, probably some kind of Japanese name, please <laughs> put Dr. Me. Mario back in here. Dr. I know you're Mario. watching this right now because we have like billions of followers and subscribers, so take Not my true. advice and use it. <laughs> we probably only have like 10 share the followers. Video, share, the video, followers. <laughs> share the video if you like it because we need your help. <laughs> Rate, subscribe, comment. Yeah. Like, who, who, so that's someone who wants to see back. Who do you want to see like just anyone from ever? So a character I'd like to see, and this might be a little bit um, skewed because I just saw a video and I found out he was supposed to be in the original game, possibly. I did a bespoke <laughs> of this character. And I'd really like Mew to be in the game. I think Mew would be really dope, really unique. A lot like Olimar, another very small character. Eh? I'm a small character. And so, like, I think his moveset could be very unique, hovering around telepathic powers. Telepathic. Telecopath- telecopath- he, 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 <laughs> slap. <laughs> I'm sure at least at one point he'll be in, like, a bubble like he was in the N64 Pokemon like Snap. Like his up B? Yeah, his up B could be or, a bubble. Or, or, like, or, I think or, in general, I just like up B moves, it sounds like. <laughs> I was talking about Tails up B. So yeah, uh, I hope Mew gets into the game. Do that, do that, Nintendo. I really have no idea who I would think. Like, I haven't thought this much. I mean, <laughs> this is I, your topic. <laughs> I kind of wanted to see Mewtwo back. I have fun with him. Okay, so he said not returning. You said anyone, didn't you? I said anyone. I kind of said anyone, oh, but then... Okay. Yeah. yeah. Mewtwo. I like his moveset, so I agree. His up B move was pretty cool too, right? Well, I like his B move more. Oh, okay. How about you, Ray? Uh, I just thought about this top of my head. Like, I don't even so much want to see the characters from it, but Contra. I don't know if you guys played it for the Nintendo. Mm. Like, I want to see their guns in it. No, that cool. gun that has like the three directional, really like cool. really do, 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 do. That was like my favorite weapon in there. I used to do the Konami code on that. So, up, up, down, down, left. Little known fact. Uh, one of the characters that they wanted in the game originally, I think for the N64 one, was the Excite Bike. But they didn't know how to do that as a character, like how he would jump, for instance. On a so, bike. So they didn't. A but ramp comes out of nowhere. What's pretty cool is they basically kind of did that with Wario because he could bring out yeah. that bike. And it even like when he gets off of it, it does the up wheelie thing that it would do on Excite Bike. So that's pretty cool. How they integrate stuff that they like kind of canceled out before. Another character I would like to see on there... Um, you already had your character. Well, I want to have a second. <laughs> so, <laughs> another character I would like to see on there is Battletoads. I think oh, that would man. be That'd really be cool awesome. to have them in there. Yeah. Another character you want to see is Battletoads. <laughs> <laughs> see, my English is not that good, but you guys understood what I'm saying, hopefully. Battletoads. With, with that request, I hope uh, the Teenage Ninja Turtles... Yeah, are, that's what I was just thinking. Or one character. Oh, <laughs> shell shock. <laughs> my toe, my toe. Pizza time. <laughs> they should really just pull from their classic Nintendo library of all the best games back then. I mean, they did like revive... They, Kid, they re- did revive Kid Icarus. Yeah, they did. So and Ice back. Climbers. That's true. So. so that's pretty cool. And Little Mac now. Uh, yeah, I guess they're and doing And they've been that. wanting okay. that. <laughs> you got a friend. You're on with this. You're on something. But... Think about this. What if they repackage the 3DS? Because we haven't had a or a 2DS. We haven't had one of those come out in a while. Repackage it? Why? What? To add like a Smash Brothers bundle. Oh, I'd be down. Yeah, Weird. that's why. To I put said like the game. What? Not why. Oh, that's what. Or <laughs> why? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'd be down. I really like um, their handhelds in general. Like when they, whenever they do like crazy colorways of it and stuff like that. Did um, you get the 2DS? 2DS? What? No, I didn't. Um, mm. I didn't. Yeah, I don't think you got it. I didn't get it. I didn't get it, friend. Ah, I didn't think that was much practical. But so, what is this bundling about? Like, say they get like a new 3DS, 3DS XL or 2DS XL, and then it comes with the video game, and it's like a special kind of that circle with the lines through it. So they on the back, they they package the the brand new release game with the system because they assume in a lot of cases certain games are system sellers. So they pack, pack, package it together. The system itself has certain details that the normal one wouldn't, whether it's a special colorway, special detailing, and it might be priced a little bit better or pretty much the same as if you bought the two things, mm-hmm. depending. Thank you, fam, for explaining that. That's very what well. a bundle is. He explained that very well. 
Well, thank you. I appreciate <laughs> I appreciate your time and my effort. Like an adult. <laughs>